Hey Josh, what are you wearing? I'm wearing like a blue button down. I'm wearing blue too. You're wearing a different type of blue, so you're fine. All right, thanks. All right, guys. Let's go. Let's get in the car. Matt, Josh, Sarah. Let's go. Easter Sunday. Let's get in the car. Getting five kids ready for church on Sunday morning is hard enough. Sometimes Tani and I just need some help. Time to go to church for Easter service. Take it home. There's, a, there's gonna be an awesome play. Me and Josh try to help out my dad as much as we can by helping Sarah get in the car. But usually it's impossible. Especially now that we got our portable DVD player for Christmas this year. Alright guys, we're on our way to church. Now listen, when we get there, they're gonna have a play called The Prophecy. Y'all understand what the play is gonna be about on Easter? Yes, Dad, we understand that. You understand, okay? You understand the importance of Easter. Easter's the day that Christ was resurrected from the grave. And in this play today, you guys are going to see a lot of real life activities of what happened with Christ from the time that he was crucified until the time that he rose. My family attends a Christian church and I think it's important to explain faith to our children and answer any questions they may have. It's made a huge difference in our lives and it's the center of our family. How about an Easter egg hunt? No? Yes. So Josh, you're not interested in an Easter egg hunt? How about you, Sarah? Wait, you want to go Easter egg hunting? I'm almost 13 now, and my brothers give me a hard time about how I'm too cool. But I don't know. An Easter egg hunt seems a little bit kitty to me. Sarah, you want to go Easter egg hunting? Yes. I'll get a gun and Josh, I think you might get interested if you find out there's a $20 bill in the hunt. Maybe. All right. I take it all back. Sarah, are you ready for the Easter egg hunt? I'm gonna get that golden egg before you. Oh yeah? Yeah. I'm gonna go run super fast for you. You're weak. Yeah, you're weak. You're weaker. You're the weak ahead. You're weak. You are the weak. No, I'm not. <laughs> I told you every time, I'm not. Me and Sarah have always had a really special bond, especially since we're the babies. I was born and then she was born light. I don't know, like a few years later. And so I always give her a hard time. Leave the gold egg and dad, leave it in there. I'm gonna hide it. Yeah. Yes. Protect the best spot. You know what I'm gonna do? See over there underneath that deal? There's the golden egg, guys. Right up there. All right, guys, rules of engagement. All the eggs are hidden now. We're gonna go and look for them. And. You can't get the golden egg because you already hit them. Oh. 20 bucks. $20 in the egg. $20? Yeah. Or money. <laughs> money, oh. You can't get okay. the money. Golden money. Whoever yes. finds a golden egg gets a $20. Josh is disqualified because he yes. can't hide. You can help Sarah pick up some eggs. Go. Sarah. You can't help her find the golden egg. Try to find, find the golden, the golden egg. egg. Okay, I'm gonna find it for Matt. Oh, okay. Right, before Matt does. Dad, wait, Dad, this Sarah? is unfair. He says that he's gonna let Sarah find the golden egg. See, my dad's been telling me and Matt about this $20 golden egg, and Matt says he's gonna win it. But I help hide the eggs, so I have a pretty good feeling Sarah is gonna win this egg. No. How would Josh can help? Josh can help? Yes. You gonna beat Matt? No. no. Alright, guys. <laughs> Here we go. We okay, but go Matt needs a bucket. Just a moment. We gotta get you gotta a bucket. No, I'm you. only going for the golden egg, so uh, I don't know. How do bucket. you know which one's the golden egg? Because Graham showed it to me. She showed me all the eggs. Uh, all right. It's, it's just pink and gold. Sarah will find the golden egg. Okay. Right, for the golden egg. On your mark, get set, go. Move on. Oh my God. More by the tree, Sarah. <laughs> I know by the thoughts of that thing. You're ice cold over there, Matt. You're like in Antarctica. What the heck? I'm going to win! You're getting behind it. Ah! Get up, Mom! Help! Look, you right back there on the fence. Am I getting warmer or colder? Oh, can't tell you now. I gotta admit, giving Matt the wrong directions is pretty fun because he's competitive, even if it is just his little sister. Found it! Run! Just kidding! No golden egg here! I just found the golden egg, but I kind of feel bad because I know Sarah's gonna be sad if she knows I find it. 
So I'm gonna let her find it too. Where is the golden egg? Ah, behind the tree. I don't see it. <laughs> oh, no. 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 You got the golden egg. Aww. That's worth money, Sarah. Let me see that. No, nope, hey, that's Sarah's I know, golden egg. I know it is your egg. I'm just looking. No, it's not fail. All right. Mal's a pretty good sport letting Sarah find that golden egg. But I think a $5 donation to the Egg Hiders Association would be a pretty good deal. 15 and 5 all good? Yeah. Happy with that? All right, 15 and 5 it is. Sarah thinks it's worth 5, so she's good. At the end of the day, Easter to me is all about love and sacrificing for others. So giving $5 to Sarah so she can be happy too is more than appropriate for the occasion. Any day I get to spend with my family is a great one. And hey, 15 bucks for finding an egg?